You can't help but feel you forgot something. A strange device of gold and glass with a funny spinning needle. Hmm.
An old fireplace. Chilled by the cold stone walls, you quickly light it up. Some warmth will do you good. The fire looks inviting, and the weariness of the last hours or days washes over you. You cuddle up next to it and fall fast asleep. Finally, the Council of Elders have come to Dreadrock Mountain to help you fight the dead. If only you could somehow get in touch with them.
crypt of the family of Vor, the ancestors of the kingdom that built these halls. The dead king's... This is the tomb of the family of Avor. Show some decency and enter an armed filthy peasant girl. A female voice echoes in your head. Leave, unworthy traveler, and let us and our noble family rest in peace. She loved raising eagles and falcons for hunting. Some called him fierce. Some called him angry. We called him son. He could have been king, but he chose his desires over our heritage. When she played the harp, it sounded like the voices of a thousand angels. All he ever longed for was a decent woman to keep his company for a while. This, this is the tomb, is the tomb of the... remains of some poor soul that died in pain and loneliness. This path would lead
So now you know. Your dreams do reveal the truth. The Elders are all the way above you at the gate fighting. But whatever their plans may be, they clearly didn't come to help you in your quest. Fighting a wave of desperation. You take a step down the stairs. Ha 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 ha!